are getting our workout on. I'm joined here with the girls on the run. How are we doing this morning? Yes! Good. That's the energy we all need bright and early. Okay, girls. So I'm going to have you turn around, face Steve. And I know at the beginning of all of your girls on the run practices, you always set the intention for practice. So tell me a little bit about some of the goals that we're setting for today's practice. Um, usually we'll do our, like what we are going to be learning today, and then we'll set our lap goal before we do our main uh, workout. Got it. So you guys typically have your running practices after school, but I made you guys wake up early this morning. Do we yeah. still have the energy? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to send you guys back around. Keep doing some laps while I talk with Stephanie a little bit about Girls on the Run. Good morning, Stephanie. Hi. How are you? Great. How are you? Thank so you. These are some wonderful girls. Not only do they have the enthusiasm, but they're so <laughs> confident. I mean, what are the odds that, you know, when I put a microphone in front of them, they're talking so confidently. Yes. So tell us a little bit about what Girls on the Run is. So Girls on the Run is an after-school enrichment program for girls in grades 3 through 8. And yes, as you can see, there is running, but it's so much more than that. It's not a track program. We're not a running program. We're really here for what you said, confidence, mm. self-empowerment. So the girls, long after they've crossed that 5K finish line, are ready to take these tools that we work with them on, like friendship and empathy, how to talk about feelings. All feelings are normal and natural, but now what do we do with them? Now that we talk with them, that they get to work um, when they do their laps, they're ready to take on that big test at school, that paper, anything that comes at them, these girls are ready. And an added bonus is the friendships that they're able to build when they come to these practices. Absolutely. What have you noticed in the girls and the transformation from when they first started versus now? I actually was talking with one of the girls today. It's not just their, that they can run more, that they're getting that stamina, but they feel so much better when they see their friends at school and when they have PE and they had to run a mile. And they both said, I felt so much better when I saw her doing it, that I knew she could, she knew mm -hmm. I could, and they could lean on each other for that strength. And that's exactly what we want, is we want those girls to connect and make those friendships. So, all right, ladies, final lap. I'm going to have you guys meet me all right here. Come on, come on, come on, come on. All right, and stop in front of Steve. Stop in front of Steve. Okay, how are we feeling? I'm going to let you guys all catch your breath because I know we ran very hard. Actually, all the folks at Good Day, I know we were breathing pretty heavy after our 90-second basketball games that we were having earlier, and these girls just ran a bunch of laps. How many laps did we run? Um, I don't know. Lost <laughs> count. Lost count. Four. Four. Okay, so tell us how you feel at the end of a practice. Uh, tired. Um, yeah. Uh, it's fun. It's fun? It's tiring. It's tiring? But do you feel good at the end? Yeah. Yeah? Okay, how do we feel? I feel exercised, and I feel like I can run, like, the 5K this year. You can run the 5K. Ooh. Okay, so that's what we're kind of hoping is the end goal, that we can run the 5K? Yeah. I feel I'm more motivated to You're do more, more stuff okay. and confident. On the, on the count of three, I want all of us to say, you know, how we're feeling right now at the end of this run. One, well, I didn't run, so I, I'm, I'm not going to participate, but on the count of three, you're all going to say at the same time. One, One two, two, three. Hi! I love it. So I also know that you guys have a very special cheer that you wanted to show us. Yeah. So make sure you're facing we Steve so mom and dad at home can see you and grandma. All right, I'm going to join in. I'm going to hold the microphone for you guys. We're going to do banana. The banana. The banana. Three, two, one. Peel, banana. Peel, peel, banana. Peel, banana. Peel, peel, banana. Eat bananas. Eat, eat bananas. Eat bananas. Eat, eat bananas. Go bananas. Go, go bananas. Go bananas. Go, go bananas. Go, go bananas. Go, go bananas. Again, these are the girls on the run. They're getting confident each and every day. They're getting their workout in every day. And we're having fun, right, girls? Yeah! All right, these adorable faces. Oh, actually, Stephanie, quick question. If anybody wants to get involved with Girls on the Run, how does that happen? Uh, visit our website, uh, www.gotrsac.org. We're also on social media on Facebook and Instagram, and we'd love to have you. 5K, we're looking for volunteers, and just to come out and help cheer on these girls as they complete their 10-week goal of completing that 5K. Let's go!